Hello everyone, welcome to Techie Giveaway channel. In this video, we are going to see how to do more action with the uh, iOS app using APM automation. Okay, so this is our old script, which is a uh, failed one. So we simply put ID is equal to name, so it won't click anywhere. The app which you are going to use is UI catalog. Just go to uh, APM server and just start it. For example, just like you will get it like this. Just start the server, go to search. Here you need to find the element of any app. For example, if it is Android, you can use UI Automator Viewer. So for iOS, what to do? So that's like most of the guys will question what to do, what to do. So in APM, there is a APM inspector. Just to click on the search icon, you will re redirect to this window. Here you have to enter the capabilities. So whatever you are entered in code level, I have some in my reference. I will open it in capabilities. Platform name is equal to iOS, platform version 11.1, .1, which is the device and the path where I have stored my app. So everything we have to give. Then if you start the session, it will install that app and it will show you the screen here. So just wait for some time so that you will understand what I'm trying to do. Yeah, the screen came here, right? The same thing will come on inspector as well. Just a second, it's loading. Yeah, it's loaded. So uh, if you want to click, for example, I will create one scenario, which one I will take. Okay, uh, go to alert view, click on simple and click on okay. So this is the scenario we are going to do with this. Okay, so I need to find the ID for this. Go to alert view just navigate to this i can see not id accessibility id it's okay just copy here you won't find any accessibility id and all here by accessibility id there is nothing like that so you have to use id only so in the place of name you just put whatever you copied there the same way driver dot find element by id i want to click on simple now so let view, I want to click on simple. So I just navigate to this and just refresh this uh, screen. So it will show this. Okay, for simple, I need to find the ID. Yeah, accessible ID is simple only. More is there, let me copy paste. I need to click on simple and how to click on OK. Let me try to find. If this web based app, we can directly simply do drive dot switch to alert dot accept alert. OK. Accessibility ID, accessibility ID is there. OK. So we can use OK here. So we have all used click only. It's actually very simple. Like uh, if you have, we have actually text to field very down. You have to use swipe and all in the first tutorial only. If I tell you swipe, it will be too tough to understand. So, for example, this simple way I can show you. Just refresh and try to find this locator. Okay, so X path is there. Okay. Using the X path can copy paste as of now you just copy paste uh, sorry mm -hmm. just copy paste everything just go driver dot find element by xpath you have to enter your xpath expression dot send keys so you can able to enter some text in the text box if you want to enter anything but in this scenario, we are going to cover this last line. Is it's uh, very down? We need a swipe action as well that we can do it in maybe in future videos. Let's see uh, the current scenario which we have written is click on alert view, simple, and OK. Okay, so our uh, service already started. No need to restart and all. Just let it be. 
once done you just run the script watch your apn logs as well as the emulator what happens it will actually reinstall if you see here it will reinstall actually yeah it will click on alert view yes then simple okay yeah that's it we are able to do some scenario like uh, we have uh, navigate to do some other screen click on alert and the send keys also i have given demo that we can cover it in maybe in future videos thank you guys please subscribe our channel if you face any issue please put into comments so that i can uh, like uh, try and give it to you the solution as well Thanks for watching.